hello guys uh, today i'm talking about the text style and how can we use a text style on different text widget uh, suppose there is a text and there is a four uh, see one text two three and four line there is four line text uh, suppose it's one it's two three four okay there is four text widget and uh, that says same property okay now uh, for this uh, there is four text and for uh, i need to re reuse the text style so first of all make a text style see font size make it 30 and the color would be colors dot uh, red okay red and uh, font weight dot bold so my text font size is 30 color is red and font weight is bold so uh, just reload the app okay see one two three okay now i have to use the same font size for this other text okay for this other text i have to use the same font size and the color will be different or i have want to use the same color on the same property but i want the font size is different same goes for font width okay now uh, I am what I am to do. I am going to do is copy and paste okay. and color is green. Okay. So what is this? Uh, this is the as the same font size color I am using. Same thing. And these two are the same as before. So this two is extra. So let's create a text style as like our custom text style. So here I create okay get this text style okay text style and is my my custom text style okay which is text style and uh, so let's copy our property now let's create our okay this font size make it font size uh, i'm just initial it nothing font weight font weight dot uh, bold okay then uh, font color okay. colors dot mm, yellow yellow or uh, indigo colors is indigo okay it says for constriper okay okay and we will not use cons modifier because we have to remove it okay let's see so what is this i will first make it okay watchable so what i'm seeing there is two text one three text and four text okay i have to use the same font size of this project sorry of this widget text widget okay and uh, let's here second bracket and close what font size font weight and color we have to initialize every one of these three properties hello okay there is a two types of properties required and non-required required means you have to put the value you manually every time when you call this widget and not required is easy because you have to initialize its value first then you can change it when you call how to change it just watch like uh, font to it font size okay so font size is my font size so what is the type of this value double okay just double 
and my font size equal 10 so what does it mean that's mean our main our default font size is 10 for this my custom text step okay now for the font weight okay okay let's what is the font weight property you can declare it bar or you can declare it dynamic dynamic is better for the bar or dynamic differentiate you can search it on google and read okay so my font weight my font weight so dynamic my font weight equal font weight dot bold is the default value and again for color same say let's say dynamic color equal uh, colors dot orange okay and the font says make it 30 okay so we'll see i have three value the font size default value is 30 my font weight weights acha, acha, okay i it's g my font weight is bold my color is orange so cut this all repeated code okay cut this cut this so, okay so style my custom style means my custom style so what is the issue there is the issue because we have const see that's why no suggestion appeared see my custom text step okay let's see for the one okay see our color color is oh, oh, oh sorry sorry so after initialize every dynamic it's my color so my font weight my font weight my color should be put in here okay so now reload it see orange text size is 30 and color is orange so my default font size is 30 color is orange and font weight is bold now look, just copy and paste this style sorry was the problem problem is identical oh. double commas so what you can see you can see the every text has font size 30 every font color is orange and font width is bold so you can see see cursor here and see my font size 30 my font weight bold my my color is orange so i have to change number two size is 50 okay then my font size my font size make it 50 sorry 5 50 okay see number two oh sorry <laughs> i am increase the number of number one let's cut and put here what i'm saying is so, so like make it 100 okay. so that's all this and now i want to number four number four color is color is mean my color my color is colors dot what we want we want green okay and uh, this color is sorry my color if you forget your custom value name custom parameter name just 
move your cursor in my color okay just double click copy paste nice colors dot uh, black black number three is black number two make it so font weight my font weight font weight dot dot what will uh, normal okay see the normal and this one font size my font size make it 60 see if you does not put any value then equal it will take the default value of this property so, so now so this is the custom text style you can make it easy for your text you can also create custom text i mean this custom text just you can change this one also simple just we will talk it about the next video thank you